Hello YouTube, this is the Hoover and Sun Sports Card Channel. My name is Brandon, and I am alone today. But normally on Sunday, which I'm, I'm going to probably release this tomorrow, Monday, but I'm filming it Sunday night. Um, I like to do uh, mail pickups and all that for the week, kind of a recap. Um, so I'm still waiting on it, everybody knows the situation with the post office, so no worries. I did have the boombox, the high-end baseball, as you can see there. So I figured, what better time than now to uh, rip into that. And technically it came in the mail, so it's not too far off of what the schedule normally is. There's the packing peanuts. A lot of these everybody's seen open already, so we know what's in them, but nonetheless, let's see. So our, our one touch, which is the screw down still. Our literature, which is, let's see, 2021 Series 1 Jumbo, 3 hits, uh, 2020 Gypsy Queen, Heritage High Number, and Bowman Draft. And we did not get the Brett Hall of Fame ticket promo, as you can see there. Let's clean this up a little. One touch. Alright, let's see what we got. So... There's our 2020, yeah, 2021 Series 1 Hobby Pack, uh, 2015 Bowman Draft, the Jumbo Pack of 2021 Series 1, Heritage High Number, which I had not picked up at all this year, um, 2020 Update Hobby, that's a hobby of the Heritage Gypsy Queen, and 2014 Bowman Draft. So... Oh, let's see. We'll just kind of do them in order. Uh, release. Okay, okay, here we go. And if you saw, I don't get these every month. Um, I like to, I love subscription boxes. I like to get them when uh, there's not a lot going on. If anybody saw the video, I, I believe it was January. I would pull the Trout Relic. <coughs> Excuse me. An auto, some really nice uh, Robert rookies, and so on and so on. So here we go. Yeah, focus. Okay, Dominic Smith, Connor Joe, first Bowman. Take that. Got some shiny stuff coming. Okay, Alex Verdugo, Verdugo, first Bowman. That's a nice one. And that's a really nice one. Michael Kopech, first Bowman. Not numbered. And I, twenty fifty. I don't know what the parallel is, or what that's called. Let's see who else. Spencer Turnbull. First Bowman Chrome. Also nice. Jordan Schwartz from Oakland's first Bowman. And, and Aaron Dola first Bowman. That was a really good pack. In fact, I'm going to sleeve up the Nola. First Bowman. I'm going to sleeve up the Verdugo first Bowman. I do like him. I think he's going to... Of course, being a part of that big trade with Boston, I think he's going to have a nice career. We'll see if anybody can knock those two off. And, you know what, I'm also going to sleeve up that Kopech. First Bowman, which hopefully he has a bounce back season. I know he opted out last year. I'll put that, in. Well, that is a really good pack. Good start to this box as well. Now, 2015 Bowman Draft. Let's see. Man, that's that's a first bone, but these are really hard. Demi or Amolier? Not familiar with him. Andrew Moore, first bowman. There's a bowman chrome of Lucas Williams, first bowman. Austin Ray, first bowman. Adam Brett Walker. I'm sorry guys, these names are really Hard to read. Nick Gordon, Bowman, and Lucas Sims. So as good as the first pack was, I would say the second pack really kind of even things out. And that's what happens with baseball cards. You have a great pack, a great box, and you get some dud packs, boxes, whatever. Anyway, on to the Gypsy Queen. 
see that focus. There we go, Strasburg, Garver, Lester, Kershaw, and a Wheel of Fortune Acuna, which is nice. Tear to the Diamond. Take that. Sorry. Fletcher, Segura, and Blake Snell of the Rays, now Padres. Not bad. I PC Acuna like a lot of guys, so take that. This is the 2020 update, which I'm sure people are tired of seeing, but you know, I didn't hate the product as much as a lot of people. I like kind of the uh, retro, you know, home run derby and all star cards. Thought they were kind of cool. All right. But I'm not gonna, we'll go through this one a little quicker because, like I said, everybody's seen this. Pujols. Houston, we have liftoff. McCutcheon with the Pirates, which is awesome. I love seeing Cutch with the Pirates. Another Pujols. Mustakis. Rookie of the Year, Devin Williams. Rookie card. Encarnacion and a Cy Sneed rookie card. Right. This is Heritage High number. Like I said, I haven't picked any of this up. Um, I've come across it a few times at Target and did not pick it up at all. Cervelli, DeCalso, Torrens, Chad Wallach rookie card, top for top performer Yoshi Tsugo rookie card. Pretty cool. Ginkle rookie card, Stuart Galvis, and Lamonte Wade Jr. rookie card. Cool. All right, last two packs. So we got off to a really solid start, but it's kind of slowed to a halt since then. Let's see if we can get any of this hobby, 2021 hobby tops. Bo Burrows, future star Bo Bichette, which is cool. I have a hobby box of this I'm going to break into at some point. Um, just not sure when. Jay Bruce. Sugard. Malik Smith. Crawford. Oh, that's cool. Cool Ted Williams. We got Kevin Bijo on the back. I pulled the Clemente version of this. Uh, Earlier in one of the packs I opened, I really like that car, like the Ted Williams as well. Last would be the 2021 Jumbo. Still no autographs, no cards, nothing like that. Might have something in here, we'll see. Okay. Right, Matthew Boyd. Like I said, I won't go through all these just for time, and, and so much of this has been open. Rather all future, so we'll just try and point out the uh, the uh, rookie cards and the better cards. Uh, Jimenez rookie card, Nick Madrigal rookie card. Cool stuff's in the middle. Let's see, if we can't do that. I don't usually do that, but since this is the last one, why not? Oscar Mercado. Kevin Biggio, Orioles team card. Okay. Humberto Mejia rookie card. Tavares rookie card from Texas. Minor. World Series Kershaw. These feel a little like upper deck. Where you just got to keep turning them. But it's a small hindrance. Kiermaier, Danny Mendick, Clevenger. Man, how good is San Diego going to be? I, San Diego, LA, in the West, um, if everybody stays healthy on the pitching side of things, could be quite the uh, race. Luzardo, Future Stars, he's in everything I open. Christian Javier, rookie card. Spencer Howard, 
Verlander doesn't look like he's going to pitch this year. I guess theoretically he could come back late in the year, maybe for the playoffs, but I don't know. I guess it depends on, on how well Houston's doing, what they'll do there. Let's see. There's some Bader. D. Strange Gordon. Glaber Torres. Something shiny. Let's see what we got. It's a Joey Bart rookie card. Pretty cool. Like I said before, I'm not super high on Joey Bart. And there's a Molina Relic. Possibly future Hall of Famer. Game used memorabilia. That's cool. Cool. Not numbered or anything, but pretty neat. With the Bart, we have Derek Jeter. And a through the years, Allen Ginter. That's cruel. I was just talking to my friend about that, how they put these autographs there. Wait a minute. See, it says top certified autograph. Yeah, 2019 tops out and get to framed autograph. It's a reproduction. It's a repro. But I don't know why they feel like they got to do that and mess with people. That would have been awesome had that been real. Last two cards. Oops. I haven't done that in a very long time. But nonetheless, Garrett Cole and a pirate that I am high on is Mitch Keller. So there you go. There's our high-end boom box with the uh, Molina relic and the Joey Bart um, foil. But like I said, the first pack was the best pack with the Verdugo first Bowman and the Aaron Nola first Bowman. Um, and of course the Kopech. So anyway, that's going to do it. Uh, we appreciate you guys watching. If you haven't already, consider subscribing, liking, comment on the videos. Let me know what you guys think. See you later. Bye.